So thanks everyone for coming. Uh, it's, uh, and it's also good. So Christian joined me last minute. That's why it's not on the slide. Um, as a remark, I have um, a lot of meetings lined up back to back because there's a great software for uh, Noah. Christian is your short notice. So anybody who wants to see a short notice, just jump on him after this talk. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. <laughs> so okay. uh, we're both very happy to be here. Um, as Marco said, this is the first time that we're um, saying something about Auto One Group or presenting Auto One Group in public. So I hope this will be interesting to you. Um, Haka, maybe we um, start with um, basically the video. The video will explain you. This is actually a, a TV clip that we're currently running in Germany, um, which will be very briefly giving you an insight of what we're actually doing. As one sentence uh, before that, the first uh, car that we actually bought was on 16th of August 2012. And this is a little bit the process on how we started it. So maybe we can show the video right now. Not sure if it works. Wir kaufen dein Auto. Jede Marke, jedes Modell. Ohne Theater, ganz einfach. Und du bekommst sofort dein Geld. Denn wir kaufen dein Auto. Gib online deine Daten ein und du bekommst eine kostenlose Bewertung. Vereinbare einen Termin in einer unserer Filialen und schließe den Verkauf ab. So einfach wie wir kaufen dein Auto.de. Ja, so what we are doing, we are buying and selling cars. Um, as the video just said, uh, it's a very simple process. We are operating multiple brands uh, across Europe. Um, one of the main brands, as you just seen, as we're Kaufmann and Auto. Maybe Hakan, we can go on to the next slide now. Uh, this is a little bit what we have been doing since uh, we bought our first car. Um, so it's the fastest growing company in Europe right now. Um, we are. We have closed 2013 with uh, 16 million of revenue, closed 2014 with 130 million, and then we basically 5.7, uh, multiply this 5.7 times, um, and we have so far booked revenue of 750 million in 2015. Um, we've been growing throughout all of the years and the month, uh, more than 20% per month. Uh, and this is possible because we are running in one of the most uh, largest markets of the world, uh, which in Europe is a 300 billion plus market. You see a little bit the distribution here. It's one of the largest markets in the world, as I just uh, mentioned. Uh, and it's still growing. For instance, if you take Germany, 65 million uh, when we start, 65 billion uh, euro when we started, uh, now it's 70 billion. And uh, yeah, this is why we are uh, keeping that growth. And uh, yeah, we're very excited that we have that. The next slide shows you a little bit um, our partners that we work with across Europe. Um, so this is all the trading partners that so we've really established that network of traders around Europe. And uh, yeah, uh, this partner network is enabling us uh, to grow in the respective speed that we're doing. And um, yeah, we want to keep that pace. Uh, we're not in for the short-term sale or anything. And uh, I think Hakan can, you, can tell you a little bit more about the growth opportunities that we see within that business. Right. Thanks, Christian. Um, yeah, you'll see the same three slides three times over again. Uh, it's a three-tick pony. So I'll show you uh, growth again here. And um, not talking about the status quo, but give you an idea of can this grow further? Yeah, and at the same speed. To give you an idea how big the market is, in our best markets, like Germany, we have less than 0.7% market share. Um, and that is in units, it's even less than revenue. So we're really at the beginning with one and a half billion in, uh, in run rate. And we only do TV marketing that you've seen here in Germany and the Netherlands, where the branch network density is actually high enough um, uh, to make this a reasonable marketing channel where everybody can just see the spot and drive to one of our branches. So that just gives you an idea of how much more can uh, happen in all of these markets we're already operating in. Yeah? When we talk about market, yes, we see these car registrations, but there are a lot of adjacent businesses, like who's actually financing those dealers, who's actually financing the consumers, what is the leasing market, everything that ends with a car and ends with any financial product starts with a car, obviously. And um, we are dominating supply. Uh, I mean, when people talk to us now in the industry, then um, they tell us, you are manufacturers without the burden of the factory. 
And um, um, yeah, I can confirm that. And um, when you look at this network, these are, these are not people registered on the platform. Yeah? A lot of people say, hey, this is my user base, and they click on my platform every day. These are actually accounts that buy from us, and we really have revenues uh, with them on a daily basis. Yeah? And, and that shows you the, not only the sheer size of the market, but what a platform agnostic, location agnostic platform can actually bring to the market. Because these guys over there in Bucharest, they can buy a car from a guy in Portugal and they don't have to interact with anyone. They don't have any risks. They buy in the same process. They have somebody who takes care of the logistics. They know how to handle financials. So um, that is what we bring to the market on the dealer end, and that's why they love it. We are the Amazon. Yeah? When you think about price selection convenience, we have the best prices because you can buy globally. Yeah? We have the biggest selection because we source long tail. Yeah? Retail wants long tail, but who brings long tail? It's only us. No auction provider brings long tail. And convenience, you click on a button, uh, um, and we settle it with your financing bank and deliver the car to your, uh, to your store. Uh, so it doesn't get any better for a car dealer. Uh, and when we just think about the outlook, um, what else do we have here? And, and this is top line, and top line is always great, and there are people in the market only reporting top line. We're making double-digit gross profits already on our core model, and with the, uh, with the products that we're developing right now, um, on the long run, we can more than double this, and uh, we've shown these in test runs on very significant numbers. Yeah? When you think about the future of the market, um, we have only shown you this map. There's another market bigger than this where we're also active. Um, we have rolled out to the US, and uh, we have uh, seven branches active right now. We see a better growth curve uh, in that market, and that is like the icing on the cake for our existing shareholders. And, um, it's not even in that reflected in that case in valuation. No. Hakan, maybe you can say a little bit about the round that we're raising. Sorry? Maybe you can say a little bit about the round that we're currently raising. I mean, um, what we have done is we, um, we're, we're syndicating a very good corporate um, finance structure. So now the banks come to us and say, this is really a serious business. Um, so we have uh, access to good debt. And uh, on top of that, there will be a process in the next year um, uh, in an equity process. Yeah. Last thing about the traction. When you think of all these dealers and you see them, we have a product where we don't operate any branch anymore, where the dealers just use our iPad and our underwriting technology. And we've rolled this out to 700 dealers in four months. And um, this is also, when you look at it, as this is the demand that's buying from us. Very soon, this will also be the supply that is uh, getting into our systems um, actually for us on a very efficient cost basis. Yeah, cool. So, uh, yeah, just to close this, I think uh, currently we're roughly buying between 100 million and 110 million euro worth of cars per month. I think in Europe alone, you can buy three to 400 uh, easily. Um, we are on a good track to reach that number. Uh, we are uh, as you have realized, maybe like very quiet people, so we just build our thing, we do it. We have a very clear path on how to actually go full value chain, and this means yeah, maybe 20%, maybe 30% margin. And uh, yeah, whoever wants to follow us or wants to talk with uh, us about uh, making, uh, making the business better is uh, uh, invited to do so. Thank you very much. All right. Thanks, everyone.